Well, this is weird. So today, I'm in a theme park I've never been in. It's actually a water park that calls itself a theme park, but it's actually a water park. This is gonna be weird. So in case you have not figured it out yet, today we are at Volcano Bay, and I actually have Nikki, Caitlin, and Courtney with me today. They're just all having fun. They left me behind. So guys, in the spirit of full disclosure, I need to admit that I'm not a water parks kind of guy. And the reason for that is that I was born in Florida, lived in Florida my whole life, I'm more of a natural Florida's guy when it comes to my water activities. We're talking going to the beach. We're talking about some of the natural springs they have here. We got some very nice state parks with natural springs, doing snorkeling, things like that. So when it comes to Florida water fun, I'm more on the side of uh, nature, whatever nature provides. But with that being said, we are going to give Volcano Bay a fair shot and check it out and see what it's all about. So, the two main rides I want to try today is going to be the Krakatau uh, roller coaster, the aqua coaster as it's called, and then I want to try some of the family uh, water raft rides. That blue one and the green one looks like fun. Those are like my main three things I want to try today. So, I think the first thing I need to say is that this volcano here, it does live up to the height. A lot of times we say things look better in person than on screen. I've only seen this on TV and seen it in person. Yes, it is amazing. Okay guys, so some time has passed. <laughs> How's the day going, Nikki? It's awesome. I'm seriously considering getting a annual pass. Yes, you are. For this park. The day's going well, the vlogging not so well. <laughs> no, we're having too much fun. Well, plus it's tough. Um, the rule is now you can only take a GoPro on the open water. So that's like in the big wave pool or like on the lazy rivers. Right. So can't take them on the rides. So that's hampering me a bit. Yeah, because we, we can't show how fun it is. So we've been on two rides. We have been on that blue family raft ride. Mm -hmm. I don't know the name. I can't pronounce them anyway. <laughs> uh, that was pretty cool. You like that one, Nikki? Yeah, it was a lot of fun. It was. It so, was last i had to go backwards the whole time though <laughs> he's sitting here laughing at me and the water is just right. shot over my head now we couldn't go as a family on that one because as a family we weigh too much i know we're not an overweight kind of family but well i think that's okay. my fault <laughs> <laughs> but they, they, they will split your party because there are weighing stations at each ride so yeah. but it was fun i heard the green one's fast we'll have to try that green one later okay and then the ride I most wanted to go on, we actually went on twice so far today. Yeah. And that was the Aqua Coaster Krakatau. Yeah. And that was super fun. It was a blast. Okay, so first of all, we, the first time we went, we went with like a stranger, just Rick and I. Yeah. And um, I was sitting up front and I, I swear to God, I caught air probably three times. So my booty was like hurting by the time I got out from being bounced. Well, you had two big guys in the back of the ride. I did. I was so. the one sitting up front all by myself. <laughs> it was low riding. Exactly. <laughs> and then the second time we went on with the girls, our daughters are here too. Yep. And um, that was a lot of fun. Um, yeah, all four of us could go on that one. Yeah, it was we crazy. We made the weight limit we on that just one. just made it. Yeah. <laughs> But that was super fun. I love that one. Um, and now yeah. we're here. We actually had something to eat. Mm -hmm. Let's do our Rick's quick food review. <laughs> okay. uh, there were four meals. Uh, now, Caitlin ate healthy. She got what, like a turkey wrap. Yeah, she got like, from the grab and go. Grab and go with uh, veggie chips. Yeah. She's the healthy one. She's doing good. Yeah. Me, I got a big fat bacon cheeseburger. <laughs> now, I liked it because I like the bun. The bun looks like the Hawaiian buns. You know I really like Hawaiian buns, Nikki. So, oh. Yeah, I do. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that, that was really nice. It was okay. It was a standard, typical theme park burger. I was starving. Now I'm not starving. Job done. Uh, <laughs> and you had the long board pizza, Nikki? Yeah, it's just a pepperoni pizza. But, you know, I mean, pizza. that's what I always get. I, yeah. It's my go-to whenever right. I go somewhere is just get a slice and of pizza. And Courtney got the chicken tenders. She is a connoisseur of chicken tenders. Yep. Everywhere we go, she has to have chicken tenders, and she actually liked them. Yeah, they were good. So if you have one of those picky eater kids who only eat chicken tenders, uh, they'll be okay right here. Yeah. <laughs> so Nikki, the other thing I think with the vlogging, the girls aren't so patient, right? Right. When I vlog, I seem to go at like a slower pace than what they want. Yeah and they take off. <laughs> well, this is not gonna be a super informative vlog. Um, I have a feeling that 
think it's just gonna be a fun one for us because yeah. we're still just trying to get a lay of the land like you guys because it's our first time. Yeah, first time here, so. Yeah, so we're just gonna show you how excited and how fun it is um, for your first time. All right, Nikki, I already told everyone I'm not really like a water parks kind of guy anyway. Right. So me not being a water parks guy and it being a place I've never been at, We'll see how it goes. I mean, we're doing the best we can. Exactly, and the funny thing is, is that we know, or like me and the girls, we know Typhoon Lagoon and Blizzard Beach like the right. back of our hands because we've done it ever since the kids were Every like, summer. Yes, so small. So, I mean, this is new for us, um, and the kids really, really like it. Um, we'll have to go over and talk about um, the comparison between the parks right. and their take on it from a teenager perspective. Right, at the end, I'll give a synopsis and I'll get their input. They probably won't be on camera, but they are the experts. They spent like every summer, almost every day at like Typhoon Lagoon and Blizzard Beach. Yeah. So we'll let you know how this compares using their opinions. Sounds good. Okay, so there are two lazy rivers here. Well, one's not so lazy. We're about to get on the fast one right now. I've got my life jacket on. You're required to wear this one on the fast one. Let's go hit it up, Nikki. It's kind of like we're in a tsunami. <laughs> like we're getting washed away in like Malaysia or something. Oh no. So I'm trying to figure out the best way to do this. Do we go like feet first and kind of lean back and relax? <laughs> or do we go like swim style? Like this? I'm not exactly sure. <laughs> that one section towards the end, whoosh, around the roof, that's really like... It's harsh where they have yeah. that the tsunami and then there's like some more jets. Yes, I'm like I almost lost my glasses in my hat and the water went on my nose. Yeah. So that I part was kind of dangerous and I stubbed my toe. I, I stubbed both of my feet. <laughs> oh, like ten toes have been jammed into the water. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna get on the fast one. Alright, so we're gonna get on the fast one. Alright, so we're gonna get on the fast one. Alright, so we're gonna get on the fast one. Alright, so we're gonna get on the fast one. Alright, so we're gonna get on the fast one. Alright, so we're gonna get on the fast one. Alright, so we're gonna get on the fast one. Alright, so we're gonna get on the fast one. Alright, so we're gonna get on the fast one. Alright, so we're gonna get on the fast one. Alright, so we're gonna get on the fast one. Alright, so we're I, I, I think I favor the Lazy River, which is this one. I can't stop laughing though. It's so dangerous. Okay, that lazy river is not so lazy. No, I'm exhausted. I, I, think I didn't go to the gym this morning. I skinned my knee. I jammed like eight toes. You only have any? Well, I didn't jam the little pinky toes. <laughs> little pinky toes didn't get jammed. The other ones did. And I skinned my knee. I lost like half my family. <laughs> okay, guys, still with the GoPro, we have gotten out of the crazy river <laughs> we tap into this racer ride it's going to take about 20 minutes so i say let's leave the crazy river and into the lazy river nikki sounds relaxing 20 minute lazy river then this racer ride okay guys we just got off we don't even, i'm not even catching the names of these rides <laughs> but it's this blue tube ride behind us oh my god it was so fast it was so fun that was oh that was a lot god. of fun it really was it went super fast. Oh my god, I like lost my stomach when we were doing like the little turns. Did you really? I did. Oh, that's adorable. Woo! That's great. Super fun. Yeah. Oh, now we have to go back to that racer ride. Yes. So, Nikki, the blue one's called Racky? Yeah, Racky Tonga. Like Racky Flicks. That's the Racky Flicks. <laughs> we're in line for the Punga Racers. Even though there's no lines here, we're in line for the Punga Racers. <laughs> Who's going to win? I think me. Maybe. Although, oh, yeah. I don't know, maybe like glide faster i don't know we'll see we'll see okay guys we just got off the racer ride nikki won i uh, yeah. props to you nikki you did win i give you your props i think it's because <laughs> i had a fast start but we we have some really bad weather coming in yeah. right now gotta cut our visit short so we're gonna try to walk around and get some footage but i can already feel the raindrops coming i don't know and it's not good for the camera exactly <laughs> right. so we might it's have such to, a bummer we might have to do the sign off from the garage oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> and we are back back from our day at volcano bay uh like i said it was going to be a weird day i started off with saying it's weird it's continued to be weird because we're <laughs> wrapping up from the house which we've never done before nikki no not really so we're, <laughs> so we're going to do a little being british joel and leah style ending here for the vlog yeah 
some of our favorite YouTubers. So go check them out. Yeah, yeah, check them out. Pretty cool. Uh, so let's talk about, let's wrap up our day. Let's talk about the theming of Volcano Bay. Now, I was the one who kind of joked in the beginning that, okay, it's a theme park, it's a water park, that calls itself a theme park. But I think the consensus with the family, right? Awesome theming. Yes, fantastic. Yeah. So should I change my attitude and call this a theme park now? Yes. I think so. Yeah, it's fantastic. Every bit of it was, you know, definitely themed out. So I yeah. really, really liked it. You were even talking about now you want to get season passes for Volcano Bay. Yeah, I do. Honestly, um, I took the kids when they were really little to um, all the Disney Beach and Typhoon Lagoon. Exactly. And it seems like this park is geared more towards like the older crowd, just like Universal. Mm -hmm. So it seems like that's kind of like the age grouping that they're going for is that, you know, late elementary, you know, middle school and adults. Because um, all of the rides were, you know, that we went on, we didn't get to go on all, all of them, but right. they were really fast and. Um, and know, that's what the kids were saying. Yeah, the, yeah, the speed and you know, it just. It's it, more of a for older, more thrill type water rides. Yeah, right. yeah, which we, you know, we all really like now. So. Yeah. Which <laughs> is like awesome. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And so. that's kind of the universal thing, kind of mostly geared for the little older kids, you know, teenagers, teenagers. Though they do have a little kitty park there. Yeah, they do. Yeah, there's yeah. section for the little kids. Although, I would not recommend taking young ones on that crazy river. Yeah, that was insane. There, There's like that last little loop around that little section. I was like, I thought I was going to drown twice. <laughs> that was a <laughs> wild a ride. Surfer. That was a wild ride. I don't know if maybe because I had the GoPro and I'm trying to film stuff too. No, if that I, distracted from like, you know, me keeping safe. Yeah, not at all. No, no, no. It was, it's a wild ride. So. <laughs> I wouldn't want my young one going on it. <laughs> exactly. But Nikki, of the rides we did go on. Yeah. What was your favorite? I mean, we were really looking forward to that aqua coaster. Yes, which I really, I really, really liked. Um, we went on it twice, and yeah, it, you know, so we got really lucky. But um, I really liked that one. I like the other kind of like family ride where there's like four or five people that can go on it. The blue oh, yeah. one that kind of swoops up. Oh yeah. Well, you know what? As we're talking, <laughs> I'll put some images. Maybe I caught the name of that one. <laughs> Exactly. Um, newbies, right? Yeah. Um, so, I mean, honestly, there wasn't one ride that we went on that I was disappointed in. Yeah. I I liked every single one of them. And yeah, I would definitely, you know, come this summer, invest in getting an annual pass there. Yeah. I yeah. liked it that much. Wow. No. Now, the other thing we need to say, though, we came in the off season. It's, mm -hmm. you know, it's the first yeah. week in October. The lines weren't bad. Now, in regards to lines, there's still lines. You know, even with the Tapu Tapu, but I would say, what was our longest wait? Maybe 10 minutes? Yeah, exactly. Maybe 10? Yeah, and a lot of them, we got there when the park opened at 10 o'clock. It didn't even open up really early, and we didn't have early park admission. So, um, I am curious how it would be in the summer, though. Yeah. You know, because there was a lot of, uh, you know, like, ride nows. So, we would yeah. tap into something that had, like, a 10 or 20 minute wait, ride some ride now, and then come back. So, I'm really curious how it would work in the summer. Right, you know, when it's really crowded, exactly. But there is kind of lines. I mean, if there wasn't a Tapu Tapu, then probably, you know, the line would go down the stairs and, you know, across the walkway and stuff versus only a 10 minute wait. So I did want to make that point that even with the Tapu Tapu, you will be in like maybe a 10 minute line at longest, I would say. Well, and the cool thing was, was that because everything was moving pretty, you know, efficiently, um, being that it's October, mm -hmm. we would tap in for a you know for one of the rides that we wanted to go on and then we'd go and we'd you know do a ride now on another one right. and then um even if it went past our time and our the little bus oh yes went right off, it, it we, doesn't go away There's it like, doesn't go away like a time limit like okay well you're you're it's been 10 minutes sorry you missed your chance it's just whenever yeah. you get back to it that was a nice yeah that nice was a nice feature because then we're like okay well cool we just got off this ride right. now let's go mm -hmm. and hop on the next one so i thought that was a really cool you know yeah, so I would, I would recommend this if you're going to be in the area, especially if staying in Universal. Yeah. This is a good park to visit. It's a nice, fun family day. Um, in fact, I would even say if you're going to choose between a water park that you want to visit, you know, there's Aquatica, there's Typhoon Lagoon, Blizzard Beach. This would be the recommendation would be. I think so too. Um, I've been to Aquatica before, and I really kind of like this one better. Yeah. So I mean, if we're gonna give our opinion, then yeah, I, I was impressed with it. Um, liked every ride we went on. So there you go. That's kind of our quick review of our day at our family day. So I don't the vlogging yeah. didn't go so smooth, but it was a fun family day at uh, Volcano Bay. We do recommend this as a water park for sure. Yeah. Now the last thing I want to mention is the giveaway. So when you're watching this, this is probably the last reminder I want to tell you. 
you know, to sign up for that fall giveaway that we're doing. It's either a Mickey Turvis or a Harry Potter themed Turvis. Mm -hmm. So in the description below, go check that out, sign up for that giveaway. And with that being said, don't miss the magic, don't miss the fun. Thanks for watching Rick's Flicks, and now it's time to relax. <laughs> It's a tsunami! It's a tsunami! <laughs> no! <laughs>